Hello, hello, Jeff Helvin here with the Lori Ballin team and Ballin Brands at your command. Today I wanted to show you how to hook up your Twilio account to enable automated texting and uh, manual texting, frankly, from within your command app. So I'm logged into command here. On the top right, I'm going to click on my name and then I'm going to go, to go here to settings. Once settings loads, I'm going to scroll down here and see it's actually under productivity. If it's not connected yet, it'll show down here with anything else not yet connected. So I'm going to go ahead and click on connect account. So what it's doing here is it's actually going to have you create a Twilio account on the fly. So I would put in my first name, last name, and then a credit card number, street address, postal code, and then email address and a password. Now when you see here, it actually says when my account falls below $10, Twilio will charge my card, my credit card $20, charges will appear as Twilio Inc. So what we're doing here is we're actually putting, there's no, technically there's no uh, subscription charge for Twilio itself. You're only paying for the actual usage. So uh, once I go through these steps, what it does is it charges me $20 on my credit card and then I now have a credit of $20 in Twilio. So I already have an account set up, so I'm actually just gonna show you what that looks like here in another screen. So if I were to follow through these steps, it's now going to take me into Twilio. And um, I have quite a few numbers because I have other things that are set up, but what we're looking at right here is this. There's a phone number and it says managed by KW Prod. So what this is, is this, you're going to automatically be assigned a 512 area code number, uh, which is a Texas phone number and, uh, that's managed by KW. But what we can do is we can actually just click here on the plus sign and find a new phone number that has our own area code. So I'm gonna just going to type in, like in our case, we have 702. I'm going to hit search. And then it'll actually give me numbers that are available with my area code. So instead, I'm going to buy one of those numbers. Now you'll see it says monthly fee is $1. So again, this is where that usage comes in. Of that $20, it's going to deduct $1 every month for each phone number that you have purchased. In this case, you only need the one phone number. So I would click buy on this number. Now once I've done that, I'm going to click up here under the help section and I'm going to click support submit a ticket. And I'm actually just going to ask Twilio, in this case, to change the phone number. So phone number change. And I'll say something like, please change the 512 number assigned to KW to use my 702 number instead. OK, so then I'm just going to choose phone number from the products that I'm inquiring about. And then the business impact, I usually just make the second one. It's not extremely detrimental, but it's something I want paid attention to quickly. And then I hit submit. So once I've done that, usually you'll get a, a message back within the next day saying that your phone number has been switched out. So from there, now we're all connected to Twilio. There's actually nothing else more that you need to do. Twilio is now connected in your account. So... Again, just to kind of show you those steps, I'm going to log into command. Click over here under my name. Click on settings. And then under here where it says Twilio, I'm going to connect account. Now since I'm logged in already and I already have an account, it basically just connects it for me and then reloads this page. And so now it shows that Twilio is connected. So now that I'm connected, what I'm able to do within my account is I'm actually able to go to a contact, for example. I can click on a phone number and then it actually says text this number. So I can check on that and I can go ahead and type out a text message and hit send. Now what's cool about this is that it'll actually show the interaction of the texting here over here in your activity. So when I get a text message back, it shows up under my little bell icon here and will record that response. And then of course I can text them again. 
So uh, as I mentioned before, in Twilio, what we're able to do here is we actually have a credit on there. We, we put a deposit, I should say, on there. And then from there, we get charged $1 a month for the use of a phone number. And then we get charged a fraction of a penny for every text message that goes out or that comes in. So as you can imagine, that's quite a few text messages uh, that's automated in there. Uh, that uh, you know before you're getting charged maybe ten dollars again to get your account back up over twenty dollars now the other place we're having Twilio integrated is super valuable is in your smart plan so if you have smart plans set up where we have text messages going out then those are automated and actually go out automatically based on having Twilio connected if Twilio is not connected you get a task to send out a text message instead so Definitely encouraged to uh, take advantage of that automation and the Twilio integration that you can do within KW Command. If you have any questions on that, you can feel free to reach out to us at team at balanbrands.com. Of course, you can always utilize the great resources that Lori's put together at understandcommand.com.